Well, today I'm going to work on her hair, finally. Um, now, I'm going to have to hold off on that for a minute because I got to, I do the wrinkles in the back of the dress or I'll be trying to do it on underneath the hair and it's just not going to work. So I'll do the wrinkles on the back of her dress first. Time to play with some clay. Now, there'd be a bunching up of the dress in the back of the dress where the belt buckles. And so I'm going to try to do that. All right, I got the uh, wrinkles in the back of the dress about done. At least the part of the dress that's gonna be showing. I'm just establishing the uh, leading edge of the uh, hair.
Anyway, I'll just keep doing this and I'll be right back. I got to make sure I don't have any real sharp indent, I mean, lines here. I got to round them out a little bit. All right, this is Ronsonol lighter fluid. And uh, I know a lot of you already know about how I use this, but I I get new viewers all the time. And so I have to uh, repeat this, but it melts the clay a little bit. And what I've been doing with this uh, hair, I'm gonna have to melt the clay a little bit in places to take down the uh, rough areas that uh, develop as you're working on something like this. I'm going to have to pick this up tomorrow. I've been busy on the phone most of the day today and uh, uh, with a couple of clients and uh, Foundry and all this other stuff. I really appreciate all you people who watch my videos and I love your comments. I wish more of you would make comments. All right, everybody. Uh, have a great night and I'll see you uh, next time. Good night. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. It really would help me. Also, check out the link below this video. It will take you to a review of my nine instructional videos that could be very helpful to you if you're thinking of sculpting. Good night, everybody.